Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between abrasive jet machining and ultrasonic machining. Both abrasive jet machining and ultrasonic machining are mechanical energy based processes where material is removed by impact erosion. In abrasive jet machining, hard abrasive particles are mixed with highly pressurized gas at a predefined mixing ratio and the mixture is then allowed to come out via a nozzle in a former narrow jet. On the other hand, in ultrasonic machining, an abrasive slurry, or abrasive particles suspended in a liquid medium, is delivered in the small gap between a vibratory tool and the workpiece. So, let's look into the basic differences between abrasive jet machining and ultrasonic machining in a tabular form. Difference number 1, a very high velocity jet of air abrasive mixture, at around 100 to 300 meters per second, is utilized for machining purpose, whereas, in ultrasonic machining, a high frequency, greater than 20 kHz, but low amplitude, less than 0.1 mm, vibration is utilized for machining purpose. Number 2, in abrasive jet machining, the high velocity jet is allowed to directly strike the workpiece, whereas, in ultrasonic machining, the vibration is not directly imparted to the workpiece. Instead, Vibration is imparted on an abrasive slurry that flows through a narrow gap between a shaped tool and workpiece. Number 3. Abrasive jet machining does not require any specialized tool. Intended profile can be cut by moving the work table and rotating the nozzle, if required, whereas, ultrasonic machining mandatorily requires a physical tool having inverse profile of the intended shape. Accordingly, shape of the machined feature relies on tool profile. Number 4. Abrasive jet machining requires an air compressor come dryer to deliver highly pressurized clean air. This air is then mixed with abrasive. The pressure energy is converted into kinetic energy by the nozzle and thus high velocity jet is obtained, whereas, ultrasonic machining does not require any compressor unit. Instead it requires a magnetostrictive transducer, to generate vibration, and a horn, to deliver vibration at intended amplitude. The tool is mounted at the tip of horn. Number 5. Abrasive jet machining offers comparatively higher material removal rate, in the order of 5 to 10 cubic centimeters per second, whereas, material removal rate is very low in ultrasonic machining, typically around 0.005 cubic centimeters per second. Number 6. Abrasive jet machining can be used for ductile and brittle materials, however, it is preferred for hard brittle materials due to the risk of abrasive embedment in soft materials, whereas, ultrasonic machining is commonly used for machining brittle materials, especially those which are electrically non-conductive, like glass, ceramic, carbide, etc. And, difference number 7, abrasive jet machining produces extreme noise during operation. Abrasive grits are sometimes scattered out of the chamber. So proper protection is mandatory for the worker, whereas, ultrasonic machining is relatively safe in this scenario.